Hey, welcome back to your YouTube channel. So in this tutorial video, learn how to troubleshoot and fix the common issue with your Gigabyte at GB Vision 2.2 not working properly. So follow the step by step instruction to resolve this problem. So let's start this issue when you encountering with your RGB lighting system. So let's start. Now the first solution we have to do is reinstall or assign the RGB Vision after going into safe mode and installing the driver. So uninstall or assign RGB Vision and delete it. If RGB Vision is not working, the first step to uninstall the software and on related app this is include aurus engine and any other app related to aurus so this can be done by going to the control panel and select the program feature and then installing the app so like i'm already showing in many many videos so you have to first go to program control panel in your system tray and then going to program feature then they have to find all of the apps you have to install in your system and then simply you have to right click on this and then first you have to find and then right click on this and they are the option called installation you have to click on this after installation done so you have to restart your computer then for restart in safe mode so after installing the app you have to restart the computer in safe mode this can be done by pressing the safe key and the restart button at the same time so this will bring the advanced boot option menu where you can select a slash safe mode so uninstall navigator driver once in safe mode you have to go into device manager and then right click on this navigator driver and then select uninstallation so this will remove the navigator driver from the system and then you have to reinstall your navigator driver and aurus engine after installing the navigator driver restart your computer and install the latest nvidia driver once the nvidia driver are installed so you have to install aurus and accept the installation of rg fusion if it not installed automatically if RG Fusion is not installed automatically, try installing Aorus Engine first and then Nvidia driver. So they are the second solution to try loading default BIOS setting. So simply you have to turn off your computer, then unplug it from the power source. Then after you have to press and hold the delete key as you press the F2 on your keyboard to enter BIOS. So use the arrow key to navigate to the advanced setter and option then press enter. So select the reset CMS variation and option and press enter. So confirm the reset by selecting yes and pressing enter. Exit BIOS and restart your computer. So there are third solution to uninstall Nvidia GeForce experience. Click on the start button and then setting and then apps and then look for the list of installed program on your computer and locate Nvidia GeForce experience. After finding Navity G4 experience, you have to right click on this and then select uninstallation. Follow the installation utility by following the on instruction to remove the program from your computer. So that's how you can turn your uninstallation and Nvidia G4 experience. So there are the four solutions also delete ATI2 folder for resolve this problem with your Fusion 2.2. So simply you have to open your file explorer and navigate to RGB Fusion installation directory. This is typically located at the C program files into 86 and then gigabyte and RGB Fusion 2.0. So locate the ATI tool folder and right click on this then select delete from the context menu and then confirm that you want to delete the folder and restart your computer and launch RGB Fusion 2.0. So there are fifth solution to update your driver. Sometimes outdated driver can cause the problem of this Fusion 2.0 so you have to update your driver to the latest version. So simply you have to press the window key and then X at the same time click on the device manager. So like I am showing you how you can update your driver. So first simply window plus X and then device manager and there. You have to find all of your driver you are using like they are the battery bluetooth computer nvidia and human firmware so display adapter here are the then you have to expand them then nvidia and then they are the update option so that's how you search automatically for drivers that's how you can update your driver in your system after the updating process complete you have to install and uh, for the prompts to install and then restart a computer if prompted. So these are simple solutions you have to do when you tackle the problem of your Vision 2.2.
not working properly so thank you for watching our video and i hope this video is very helpful for this issue and we will catch you in a next video